$1,300, Harbor Freight. I, I was going to do this along with the exhaust video, but uh, I, I got a little bit carried away with the recording. So I'm going to redo this one in one take, show all the tools, but it is boring. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be easy to sleep tonight. I got a little bit more of my room to clean, though. That's the only downside. So fall up here on the top drawer, we basically got all my new stuff. <laughs> the, the only thing old are these picks, this ratchet, the torque wrench, and, and the spare 10, of course. Right, so let's go over all that. The, those lights were like $7.99 each. I got another one over here, the rest of the screwdriver kit there. <laughs> Perfect <laughs> timing. <laughs> Oh yeah, and then there's six blind keys back there, impact rated. The roller camera was $4.99. I got the $50 plan. And the pliers. I got a whole plier drawer over here now. So that nice, set was dude. like six bucks, I think it said. You pull this tooth for me? Yeah, yeah. Right, yeah, and I got the little little snippy ones too. I put some of my old gear in there too. Even the oil filter wrenches and stuff. So that we're at the flyers. I went over the light. So we got the set of Allen oh. keys. That's only six bucks, seven bucks. The socket stuff, the joint rollers for every size. That was also eight bucks. Screwdriver set was eleven. The it's three eight color these ones that was uh what is it ten bucks only so not bad the extensions for this the impact ones they were like 22 bucks and i got two of them mesh pads just to be safe those are seven bucks each but i didn't end up using them because the arbor freight one comes with that oh uh, well what else do we got here the screwdriver holder as seven bucks the impact gun <laughs> that was 269 with a $30 plan I can't remember what Ivan told me it was but uh, I think it's like I'm not gonna say any numbers on how many foot pounds because I don't know for sure but yeah it's a little worker haven't haven't got around to using it yet the, the, these ones as like another seven bucks and then the set of the beef sockets they were 29.99 so a little, a little a little bit up there and then this set was like 10 bucks so like, i got a ton of new shit it, it came out to a grand 75 and then the welder was separate that was like another 300 but up in the rest of the box, I just have the gas there temporarily. I wouldn't keep it that close <laughs> on a normal day. Nice but but my just pieced together old wrench set. Like I said, everything I use on a daily is up here. Then all the welding accessories, this drawer, and then a plastic welder too. I think down here, yeah, these next three are empty, including that one. Can I rent that drawer out? <laughs> yeah, rent these three out. This one, I just got some specialty stuff, just a big ass soldering gun, pipe cutter, spring, spring compressor. <laughs> I had a chair sitting back there, it is in the way, and I just kind of quickly moved it out so I could pull my car in. And we got the cutoff wheel, we got all the wheels, a polisher. A baby compressor and a little electric screwdriver I never use. <laughs> I already showed the plier drawer. And just some random shit, hot glue gun, soldering stuff, test light, electric tape. This one's just random stuff. <laughs> Double side tape, gasket maker, thread lock, syringe, and you know you always gotta have a fire started. So yeah, that's what I did with 1300 bucks. That's all so you really need to work on everything. I just keep the clamps on the side of gas masks too. Then, then one of them little ra rattle can guns, those are convenient. Oh, that's basically the new set of 1300 bucks. Yeah, that's all you need for this stuff. More, more sockets, like different variety would be a better idea. But I just kind of went through, got what I need, and I have a, 
all my old tools just on the side stored away. My so side I, tools. <laughs> yeah, my side tools. So, so I just want to keep the new stuff up in this box. And we'll see how much I use it. If I missed anything, I'll dig it out of my other tool boxes or just go buy more. <laughs> what did this box cost? 500. Damn. Yeah, there's a little discount there. I'll put it in the back with a Ivan's truck. He pulled up behind me, so they just forklifted it in the back. And then me, him, and Joe lifted off. All we had to do was put on the handle. Oh. <laughs> it's really easy. And then it comes with these paper labeling strips that I haven't put on yet. Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah, so all I really need for this setup to be complete now is just that welder extension cord. Because it's not a normal 220. Yeah. It's yep. a welder 220. That's serious shit. Yeah, so I gotta spend a hundred bucks on a cable, but yeah, that's the toolbox setup. That's nice six minutes. That's, that's about how long I wanted that to run. It'll be easy to edit, and then I'll be motivated to edit like the three other videos I have in line now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>